what's up guys I was uh, working on the road today and one of the guys asked me why I carry so much stuff with me and um, I guess it's because I'm I'm a bit paranoid uh, I've, I've had things go wrong on a job and and I didn't have everything I needed to to fix it or I run into something I didn't expect so I, I carry as much with me as I possibly can and um, in the kit here you can see I've got various colors and uh, just about all I can carry all the time because a lot of times you run into factory colors that you know they were done with one shot or Ronin and if you have them with you you don't have to try to mix it and, and match it up it's already right there in the can for you and I bring a bunch of brushes with me of course both stripers and lettering brushes. I've got some flats and quills in there. And then I bring uh, prep all because you, you want to make sure that your stripes stick. And some reducer. And quite often I, I bring uh, some House of Color with me because something might have been striped with House of Color. And I have more of that too. And I've got quite a few more colors in one shot around. And various tapes. And I, I use that green tape to index my straight lines. I don't know if I did a demo on that. Uh, quite often when you do straight lines, it's best to run a line of tape and to show you where you're going. And you just run that pinstriper right about I don't know, maybe a sixteenth of an inch or a thirty-second of an inch away from it. And then the line comes out perfect because you've indexed it. And then you don't wind up wiping anything because it's it's all right there for you. But anyway, that's my kit and uh, some other things that I bring. I usually just pack this stuff in one of those milk crates with some clean rags. And I am very much prepared for a striping repair on the road or a full job. I do a lot of striping repairs this time of year. Uh, we've got a lot of deer hits and so uh, those those fenders and, and doors and rear quarters they need to be repaired and restriped. And as soon as the snow falls we'll have some fender benders from people bumping into each other. But anyway, that's, uh, that's all I got to say for now. And I hope you guys are all doing well and had a great holiday. And I'll, uh, I'll see you again soon.